Hi, I'm Lynette, a design specialist at Essence of Australia. Today, I'm gonna to introduce you to some of the fabrics that we use to design wedding dresses. Today, we'll talk about tulles, laces, crepes, chiffons, and satins and mikados. I will be giving you a brief overview of these fabrics, but keep in mind there's many different ways to use these in many different silhouettes. If there's something that appeals to you today, do some extra research, look around online, but keep an open mind when you go into the store because you may be surprised by what you feel and what you love when you try on your dream dress. This category is crepe. Crepe is a great fabric, especially for those that like to be comfortable, especially those that have been living in their yoga pants. It's usually lined with a knit jersey so you can get down and move around. It also is very versatile in its look. It can look casual, beachy, or even formal. You can see here in this style with no lace, it's a very clean cut and has a very formal fit. It's also um, useful here where you put lace on it and you can see the lace transitions into the skirt. The skirt is made of the crepe, so you still have that very comfortable fit but the top gives you that little bit more of that fun bridal feel. Crepe can come as a woven fabric and very often a stretch fibre is put into the fabric to allow it to move with your body. So therefore, when we cut things and put these really nice contour lines in here, it creates shape to the body, but the elasticity that's inside really helps the garment still move with your body as you move during the day. Our next category is lace. Lace is a huge category and lace comes in so many different cuts, so many different silhouettes and so many different types of application technique. But overall, you'll know if lace is a dress for you. Here in the first dress, this is made by what we call lace applique. So it's tulle with lace placed on top of it. This next dress here is also a lace dress. It has that same feature of tulle with lace applied but it also has an underbody lace, which gives an even more all over lace feel. This last dress here is what we call a sheet lace, or some people refer to it as a body lace. It's one lace that's cut all in one piece and is a completely all over look. They often come in these bold patterns. So if you're looking for something a little bit more bold and adventurous, this could be the type of lace for you. Tulle is something that's synonymous with bridal. When we think of bridal gowns, many people automatically imagine lots of tulle and voluminous skirts, but tulle actually is very versatile. There's many different types of tulle. This here is a French tulle, which is really soft, drapey, it floats, and is very effective when you're creating that ethereal type of feeling in a gown. This is probably a little bit more recognisable kind of tulle. It's a soft tulle. You can create lots of volume. You can also put fun trims on the end to create tiers and levels, but it really does create that more fuller princessy type feel. Here we've mixed it with another fabric, so it's really fun and flirty. A tulle dress may not necessarily just be with tulle. This one here you can see has been mixed with a combination of lace and a very full tulle skirt with lace applique on the hem. This creates a really all over romantic feel and really enables the bride to mix different sort of themes and thoughts into their gown. Tulle does not necessarily mean big and poofy. And at the end here, you can see this has even more lace applique on tulle, but we'd still classify this as a tulle gown. Very similar to the first French tulle, it provides very ethereal sort of veiling effect over the body. And this one even has a fun sparkle underneath. So tulle is not necessarily what we all think of tulle, tutus, ball gowns, flower girls. It's so versatile and can be used in so many different ways on your wedding day. Satins and mikados are great fabrics if you're looking for a formal feel. But satin and mikado doesn't necessarily have to mean stiff, and I can't move on my wedding day. There's some really lovely blends and different types of satins and mikados that are sewn up into some lovely designs and really still feel like you have that comfort factor on the day. Here we have a soft satin. 
It's a fluid satin, it's floaty, ethereal, and creates lovely movement when you walk. This here in the middle is a traditional Mikado. It has much more um, structure to it. So once it has these lovely contours and seams sewn into it, it fits really well to your body. It's still very comfortable, but does give that more elevated feel. It can come in different blends of fabric. So you may hear some people say silk Mikado or similar things like that. And here at Essence of Australia, we call that silk Zibeline. This style here is made in our dove satin. It's a matte satin, so it doesn't have a lot of shine that might be traditionally associated with satins. And it's also really lovely to touch. You'll be wanting to touch it all day. It feels like butter. You can see that we've shown these mostly in plain styles and very clean, chic um, sort of aesthetics, but it is also a great fabric to mix with tools and also with laces. Chiffon is a light, floaty fabric that drapes lovely, hangs very nice on the body, and whilst looks wonderful when you're standing still, it comes alive and the magic happens with motion. Often people think of chiffon and they think of getting married in the beach or somewhere casual, but as you can see from our selection today, it's not like that anymore. There's different types of chiffons. Here we have our classic chiffon, so you can see it drapes lovely, has nice hang, so when you've got it, it skims over the body and like I said, has lovely motion. This one here is a silk chiffon. So this is a little bit more luxurious. It carries uh, the light white and the draping lovely. And we have it here layered in a couple of colors. So that's kind of fun. This last mannequin here is our crepe chiffon. This is a slightly heavier chiffon. So it has a heavier drape and a slightly more formal feel. When you combine that with some fun accents like we have here with the laser cutout lace and this little plunge, you can see that chiffon really now does suit any venue and any time of the day. I hope this overview has been helpful. But remember, keep an open mind when you go into the store. You may be surprised. I wish you the best of luck and do remember, have fun.